health care is a deceiving title. What makes it so free? The fact that you do not have to pay out of pocket? Let me put free health care into perspective for you. Your taxes will increase significantly because you will be paying for people with a common cold to go to the doctor. People with highly manageable diseases like diabetes and asthma will go to the doctor just because they feel bad or their chest feels a little tight. Guess who pays for all these visits? Your tax dollars. Personally, I would resent having to pay for people's negligence just because they want to eat Twinkies and ice cream when instead they should be eating vegetables and protein with sugar in moderation. Our society has gradually gotten bigger and more unhealthy and as a result we are seeing far more medical problems like diabetes, high blood pressure, and high cholesterol. As a result from this increase, census at hospitals have shot up and emergency room census has also greatly increased. Somebody has to pay and that somebody is you. Also, free health care does not mean immediate health care. For example, if your mother, wife, sister, or daughter was diagnosed with ovarian cancer, she doesn't get immediate treatment. Instead, she's put on a waiting list along with hundreds of other women who are also waiting for treatment. Some of these women will die before their name is even reached. However, there is a way to get treatment faster. You can spend a lot of money and go what's called private. Essentially, this means you pay a doctor a lot of money to bump your name up the list. Going private is an out-of-pocket expense, not one covered by everyone else's money. So now you tell me, how free is free health care? I'm Jess Burks, and this was The Rant.